Hi, this is attorney Roy Oppenheim. On behalf of Oppenheim Law, we want to send our prayers to everyone that's currently going through an unprecedented event for the state of Florida, and that is in connection with uh, Hurricane Ian. As we speak, Hurricane Ian is about to make landfall uh, on the uh, west coast of Florida and create a devastating path, uh, something that we may not have seen since the days of Andrew. Uh, and in that context, we want to talk to you a little bit about those whose homes are destroyed or harmed by any, any uh, damage what they can do and how we can try and help you. So there are a number of things that you need to do immediately after the storm. And that is of course after your family and pets are, are safe. And that is you need to try and protect the damage to the extent it's possible. If the home is totally lost, obviously you just need to take lots of pictures. But assuming that there's a roof that's gone or there's been enormous flooding, you need to try and mitigate that damage to the extent possible. Call the insurance company they may have services that will come out and try to reduce the moisture and and get rid of some of the mold and pull out a lot of the the, the bad furniture that that is destroyed so, so you have an obligation to try and protect what is what is left so that that's number one number two you need to document the loss pictures 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 up close back far wide different types of uh, times of day in terms of the lighting just get as many pictures you can't have too many pictures to document the loss then we need to review the policy. You need to review the policy and you need to make sure that, that your insurance policy is covered. You need to decide, is it your wind policy or is it your casualty policy or is it both policies? So we need to get the policies. You need to review the policies. And once you review the policy, you need to file a claim. The quicker you file a claim, the quicker uh, you're going to be able to see some sort of compensation to get your life back, back on track. Many of the insurance companies will set up tents and they will set up vehicles, uh, uh, motor homes so that you can file a claim in, in some particular area. And so you need to do that as soon as possible. After you file the claim, uh, we need to see what additional information is going to be required for the claim to be successful. If the claim is denied, it will may be denied because you didn't provide enough information or because they are acting in bad faith or they're trying to say that it was not wind but storm surge and that it's actually supposed to be on the flood policy and not the casualty policy and it gets very complicated very very quickly that is where we come in we will assist you in appealing a claim we will assist you in appealing a low ball claim we have a team of lawyers that are ready to go uh, with our firm with other firms working together to assist you so that you can get through what, what is going to be an unprecedented event. So the lawyers at Oppenheim Law 24-7 are available for you right now to assist you in, in this process. But first you need to document, well, let's go again, you need to protect your, your property, then you need to document uh, the loss, you need to then uh, review uh, the, the policy to make sure that it is the right policy for the right claim, you need to then file the claim and then we come in in particular with an appeal to an adverse decision whether it's a low ball or it's a denial we will be here to help you roy oppenheim from the trenches god bless all of you and we wish you all the best godspeed